Mr. A here. I hope everyone's doing well. Listen, I have some uh, new activities and exercises for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy them. Stay well and we'll see you soon. What's up, Curie Colts? Today we're gonna get a little core workout in. He's ready to go. If uh, anything's difficult for you, uh, modify or just do a little bit less on these. All right, here we go. We're gonna start off just some regular sit-ups. All we'll do is we'll slide our hands up over our knees. We're gonna do 20. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, the next one. I'll do this one facing you guys. These are twisting sets, okay? So hands like this. All you're going to do is twist here and here. Lean back a little bit if you want to feel a little bit more. If you sit upright, you aren't going to feel this much. Next one is going to be flutter kicks. Flutter kicks. So what we're going to do is we're going to lay down on our back, put our hands by our sides like this, and we're going to lift our feet up and flutter kick. 20 count. Now if that's too hard, you can bend your knees a little bit. Okay. Good. And moving on to our next one. Plank. So we're going to go down to our forearms. Feet on the ground, toes on the ground. We want our ankles, knees, hips, and shoulders all in line. We're going to hold this for a 20 count. Just leg raise. Okay, you can put your hands underneath your bottom if that'll make it a little bit easier too. So leg raise, holding it six to eight inches off the ground. If you're having a hard time, just pull them in and pull them back out and hold them for about five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, here we go. Plank with a leg raise. We're back to our plank position. And we lift one leg, five seconds. Try to keep everything in line. And switch. And switch again. One more. Good. We've been through it one time. Let's just stretch our abs out because you're going to start feeling it. This is a core and ab workout. So just an easy stretch. Just go down like you're going to do a push up. And we call it seal stretch. Twist it to one side. Good. We're going to start back from the beginning. All right, second set, last set through. Uh, this time, when we do our sit-ups, we can do a little modification. I'll show you another way to do these. So you put your hands out like this, and then you lift your back off the ground, your shoulders off the ground a little, and you go and touch one heel and then the other. You don't want your legs like this out a little bit. So here we go. This is one of those exercises you'll probably feel a bit in the beginning, but the more you do it, the more endurance you build. Five, four, three, 
two, one. All right, here we go. Back to our sitting cross arms. Hands like this, and try to lean back if you can. Starting to feel it now. All right, here we go. Flutter kicks, flutter kicks. If you don't want to do flutter kicks, another way to do it is do in and outs. You can put your hands under your bottom. Okay, they go out and in. They're a little bit easier, I think, than flutter kicks. Good. Here we go. Planks. Try to get everything in line. You should feel your core engaged a lot at this point. Scissors, or I'll show you scissors. Here we go. Leg raises. with a leg raise. Here we go. Switch it. And switch it. And switch it. Good, and down, let's get one last heel stretch. Oh. All right, thanks for joining me today. A little core ab workout. We'll see you next time.